Now at this stage, we would have created our data stores, would have had the main document in front of us, that's what this document is. Now we need to look at creating the final piece, which is the merged document. Now to get this done, we would go to the button here, finish and merge. We click and we select edit individual documents because now we want to see all the letters separately. And so we click it here, we're going to select all, click OK. And what you're seeing now is the new document. You see the name here, letters one. And you're seeing the first letter to Dolores Banks. The second letter to Elroy James. Again, I specialized here. Or personalized there, sorry. The final letter to Carmen. All right. And this document now you would save as your merged document. So of course, file, save as, and you save the document. All right. So you'd save here now. First, merged document. And there you have it. So what we just did was within the mailing stand, we have um, completed our our merge document. Let me just um, so what we have in front of us here. We have the main document on this side. We have the merge document on this side. That displays all the letters. And as you'll see, page three of three, the one letter created and are able to personalize it for three persons using the main merge feature in Microsoft Word.